Welcome everybody. Um, we are going to call the name of the 14 men who were instrumental in making Belize our home. Um, this is a very important day, not only for the people of Flowers Bank, for, but for the whole country of Belize. Belize, because of these 14 men, all people here in Belize are free to go and do what they like as long as you're making the law, you're to go by the law. Um, all right, here are the 14 men who went to Belize at that public meeting, courthouse settlement at Belize Town, June the 1st, 1797. The question put to vote before the members in attendance at the public meeting with the impending Spanish invasion by sea from Yucatan, was it in the best interest of the settlement to evacuate or to stay, defend and keep possession of our same? The vote was taken, 51 for evacuation, 65 against. The majority against evacuation, 14, they are forever honored and so listed below. William Croft, yeah. David Dawson, yeah. George Rayburn, yeah. Joseph Smith, yeah. James Hercules, yeah. Cesar Flowers, yeah. William Flowers, yeah. John Dawson, yeah. Thomas Robertson, yeah. Joseph T Tony, yeah. William Pinder, yeah. William Scott, yeah. George Grant, yeah. Adam Flowers. Yeah. Of these 14 deciding majority, all except Rayburn and Robertson were black. These 12 black heroes paddled their dories from Flowers Bank and village and along the Belize River Valley to cast their historic no vote in Belize Town. This vote was set the stage for the battle of John George's Key on September 10th, 1798. By voting to not evacuate, but to stay and defend, they bequeathed Belize to our children, ensuring that it was not forever lost to Spanish Mexico or Guatemala.